hello friends and welcome back to the channel now the goal of this video today is to help each and every one of you that trade acid silver bullet strategy to help you guys to know how and when to identify only valid a plus setup in the market now we have three main sessions of trading acid silver bullet strategy which i'm going to show you guys on the chart when we get to the chart we have the london session we have the am session we have the pm session now each of these sessions daily there must be at least every setup that appear every day now you can't just be risking your money on each and every of these setup you see daily so i'm going to show you guys a simple technique that will help you guys to identify only valid a plus setup in the market so that you know when to risk your money and when not to risk your money so what i'm going to do right now i'm going to show you walk you guys through the process on the chart but first of all i'm going to give a brief summary of acid silver bullet strategy for those of you that are new to the strategy then i'm going to show you guys how and when to identify a plus value setup in the market now to trade acid silver bullet strategy the most important thing you need is the timing okay the timing now is usually one hour time window so we have three different sessions to trade as this silver bullet strategy we have the london session silver bullet we have the am session silver bullet and we have the pm session silver bullet now london session silver bullet is usually from 3 a.m to 4 a.m meaning this is the time window you are going to be expecting the setup to appear in the market the setup is what i'm going to show you guys next so from 3 a.m to 4 a.m new york time from or from 8 a.m to 9 a.m uk time is the same time all right now a.m session silver bullet is from 10 a.m to 11 a.m new york time or 3 p.m to 4 p.m uk time okay so it's the same time we do just one hour time window meaning at this one hour time window is when we are expecting the setup okay now the setup is the next thing i want to show you guys okay the setup is very simple we are looking for the first level lookup from this 3 a.m to 4 a.m okay let me show you guys the setup is very very easy we are looking for the first level lookup that formed before the time window or during the time window now there are two cases here i want you guys to make sure you pay a rap attention to what i'm showing you now this favor lookup this import swing occurred before the time window let's assume we are doing it with london session here london silver bullet strategy so this should be 3 a.m to 4 a.m all right now this import swing are already took place before the time window okay so there's a favor lookup here that we want to reference for price to come back to so we are looking for something like this for price to come back to before we can take the set to the downside all right this is prior to the time window okay then we can still have a scenario whereby the favor lookup will occur during the time window okay for example take a look at this so this is from 3 a.m to 4 a.m then the impulse swing took place during the time window and then this is the favor lookup now when you have this kind of scenario in the market you don't expect a retracement back into this favor lookup like for example an impulse swing like let me show you guys a better way so we don't expect a retracement for example if price has expanded to the upside and then we expect a retracement back to this place before we start buying no we don't expect this this kind of scenario we use immediate rebalancing of favor lookup meaning we are using the next candle okay after the favor lookup has print has been printed so we are using the next candle then we are using the week the low of that candle so it's going to trade back into this level lookup and then we're going to take the trade from this this is my best setup when trading as this fabulous strategy because i like to work with the immediate rebalancing of the favorite lookup now this kind of scenario is also good this kind of setup is also good but i'm going to show you guys how to make this setup an a plus setup but my first a plus setup is this one right here i want price to expand during the time window and then i want the next five minutes candle to trade back into the favorite lookup to just tap into it then i place my buy order here i'm going to show you guys example when we get to the chart i just want price to tap into this place and then start expanding to the upside this kind of scenario you see it mostly during the london session so i usually trade more london session silver bullet than am session so during am session i will be looking for this more of this but this kind of setup has its own limitation which i'm going to show you guys how to make it an a plus setup so let's just quickly talk about this kind of setup okay so we'll use this kind of setup for pm session and am session am session is from 10 a.m to 11 a.m or 2 p.m to 3 p.m for p.m session okay so this kind of setup i usually use it a lot because after this after london expansion during the morning so uh, there's definitely going to be a retracement into the range i'm going to show you guys an example so this is the retracement back to retrace the london expansion and then we now have a favorite lookup during that london expansion for price to trace into now to make sure we don't get at the wrong side of the market when taking this kind of setup 
we are going to combine silver bullet strategy and optimal trade entry it's called ote optimal trade entry now now optimal trade entry is one of the best trading strategy that i use as an ict student if you combine optimal trade entry and ict silver bullet stra strategy obviously you are going to have the highest win rate in the market like the setup is usually very strong and very very much reliable now how do we use optimal trade entry just for us to pick up the fibonacci retracement from this high to this low and discover that the fair value gap is not on the premium price action so there are cases whereby the fair value gap will not be at the premium or the discount price action let me show you guys an example let's assume the range was somewhere from this high to this low okay that is the impulse swing and then we measure the fibonacci from this high to this low you go to discover that obviously this level lookup is at the discount zone and we want to sell remember guys we sell at premium price action and we buy a discount price action so taking a trade at this point is very very much low probability setup so i will not take a trade from at this discount point I would rather wait for the fair value gap at this premium level. Now that's why I said if I want to trade this silver bullet strategy that makes use of retracement method to make it an A plus setup, I must combine it with optimal trade entry. Now after combining with optimal trade entry, I just wait for price to come back to the premium side or to the discount side because at every impulse swing. There can be more than multiple fever look up. You can have up to one fever look up, two fever look up, three fever look up, and each of them are on strategic location. So we want to make use of the one that is discount price action or premium price action. And that is why I'm going to go for this entry setup at this premium price action to sell from this fever look up at premium price action to the downside. Let me just quickly show you guys example on the chart. All right, so let's take a look at example on the chart. Now we are going to use Euro US dollar as our example. But what I just showed you guys can be applied to any currency pair you want to use. Um, right now, this is current price on Euro US dollar. Okay, this is December. This is December 29. Okay, this is December 28. Okay, let's use yesterday price action because right now we don't have current New York price action, current AM price action. So yes, it's yesterday we have complete price action. So let's take a look at AM session because I want to show you guys that valid A plus setup using the retracement approach. Okay. So what I need to do now is identify my 10 a.m. and my 11 a.m. time window because that is when we want to expect that setup. Okay. So where is my 10 a.m.? This is my 10 a.m. candle. Let me increase the size of this vertical line. Okay. So where is my 11 a.m. candle? Okay. This is my 11 a.m. candle. Okay. Now this is my 11 a.m. candle. So what I need to do now is open it up, go to lower time frame. All right. Now, but before I go to lower time frame, we need to first of all identify the previous expansion from London session. Okay. So you can, you guys, you see that we have this expansion to the downside. Okay. During the London session. So if I go to five minutes time frame, it's going to be a little bit clearer. So let's go to five minutes time frame. Okay. Okay, so you guys can see we had we had an expansion to the downside. Now, as an ICD trader that uses silver bullet strategy, you have to first of all wait for the retracement. I told you guys if you're trading the AM and PM session, you wait for the retracement. If you're trading the London session, you can use the immediate rebalancing whereby candles the next five minutes candles stick now pack into the immediate fever look up and then you take the trade during the London session. So now we are using AM session. We just have to wait for a retracement now take a look at this retracement take a look at everything you are seeing on my chart right here you can see that the retracement started from here and you guys know that all these are levels of imbalance but i can't take this trade or on any of these imbalance until i wait for what a premium price action okay you can see how price is respected what i'm showing you guys here now you exactly what price did is what i'm showing you now this is a time window and price came to the premium price action now the question now is where is the favor lookup we should use right here oh this is favor lookup and this favor lookup is very good because it's 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 combined with an other block you can see the other block right here so strong confluence strong confirmation a plus setup with this kind of one i can guarantee you you can even risk more than two percent of your capital with this kind of setup now you, you see how this other block right here this level look up you place your trade you set your set order right here okay you place your set order then you leave your stop loss above this other block okay now you put your stop loss above this other block right here then for your take profit you guys know how to take profit using as this fabulous strategy your first target should be like 10 pip your next target should be like 20 pip then your next target should be like 30 pip so you can be taking 
passion as well as this trade is playing on but if you are a style of trader like me that doesn't take passion i can just leave this thing to flow from, from here to the downside and then I'll, i will achieve my risk to reward ratio this is about five risk to reward ratio and what i'm going to do right now is to link a special video that also talks about as this bullet strategy for you guys to go and watch to level up your skill on tra trading as this bullet strategy and then again if you want to join our one-on-one -on -one mentorship program whereby you now have direct access to me i will mentor you directly through zoom call one-on-one -on -one mentorship and then another benefit that also come with this one-on-one -on -one mentorship is that you have access to the community where i drop my each day trading signal for you guys for you guys to benefit from so every of my trading set up trading, sig trading signal daily i post it on the telegram community for you guys to use so if you are interested in that one-on-one -on -one mentorship you can click the link in the description button below and then we attend to you guys and then we'll get started with the one-on-one -on -one mentorship so right now i want you guys to make sure you back test what i just showed you guys and then i'll see you guys in the next video thank you very much